Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Captain Puggy. Welcome to a new video. Today we're playing some Blood of the Dead on Call of Duty Black Ops 4. And today I asked myself a question. Can you beat the secret of Blood of the Dead with 3 bots? And this is a pretty interesting question because I never saw a video about it. So I asked myself, can I do it? Can I actually beat the secret? And that's what I'm gonna do for this video. And all of you now gonna know the answer. Alright, so as soon as I spawn, uh, my first strat was to just stay in the first place for at least four rounds and start uh, banking up all the points I can. Unfortunately, as you can see, bots can shoot through walls. They know exactly where the zombie at. They have freaking M bots. They're bots and they have M bots. You get it? So yeah, they start shooting even though we can't see the zombie yet. So, uh, my, like I said, my strat failed because, as you can see now, they just opened the door like it was nothing. So now I had to go outside and start opening myself some door. So as you can see, I, I start to go for the first generator. And it's pretty interesting because I didn't know that, but bullets would uh, actually fight just to open up the power. And it's pretty interesting, so, I mean, the, that does help a lot. So, as you can see, I'm starting to go to the first wolf head, and I asked myself, do the boss actually open the door I want to open, and the answer is yes, so they will open the door you're close to, and that make you, like, keep your points for the box. As you can see, I try myself on a box, and I couldn't get, uh, actually, the blunder gate, so I will get it later. And for the wolf head, it's pretty annoying because it's very, very hard to get it. As you can see, I'm on round 4. And what's annoying about that is that, like I said, bots won't let zombies get close to you. So we actually complete the wolf head at round 7. Round 7, guys. 3, three rounds later. And actually, as you can see, Brutus actually spawned uh, even though we didn't, like, go to the catwalk and everything so I already got the keys for it um, so I managed to start um, walking to get to the catwalk once I reached the catwalk I thought to myself that's gonna be pretty hard because we are we are four player and zombies will just start waving at me at round 8 but actually it was pretty easy considering the fact that the other bots were just protecting me. As you can see, I'm just reloading here, relax in the open, open catwalk, and bots just protecting me. As you can see, this is the point of view of the bots, and I'm just walking around in zombie, and they just protecting me. This is pretty, this is pretty insane. I mean, bots are pretty stupid for some other thing, but for that, they were pretty useful. And now I managed to get myself to the prison. Now, this is really interesting because, like I said, bots will open every door you close by, so this is pretty useful for you to keep your points for guns or other doors that they didn't open. And as you can see right now, I'm on the second wolf head, and that one, I thought myself that's gonna be pretty tricky because there's gonna be a lot of zombie at round 9, and the bots will just start killing every zombie in the world. So as you can see, for now, it's pretty easy because the other bots are not here yet. But like you see right now, Nikolai and Richtofen just start waving the zombie <laughs> and it's getting pretty annoying for me because I'm trying to get the wolf. Now, it took me for this wolf round, uh, one round and a half just for this wolf and this is a pretty, the much easier one. So now I need to go to the basement or the cat. I don't know how to say this word guys, you know what I'm talking about the basement, alright? Uh, as you can see now, I'm getting close to the switch, to the power switch, but one of the boats actually died. And I was asking myself, well, will the other boats go save him? And the answer is no, because they're just too far away and they want to do the walk uh, to save this last bot. So I had to go save him myself. Uh, and since I was getting pretty close to this bot, the other bots start running. For, for me like as you can see on screen they just start coming around and as you can see this is a pretty weird glitch I don't know if it's a glitch or um, just a problem I would say 
but bus start they stop moving when you wake well when you revive them as you can see some of the boats start moving so yeah i just got the power switch on and brutus will spawn right now i'm alone because one only one of the bots is moving and the two two of the others are just freeze for some reason i don't know why but they just freeze right there so yeah so i managed to get the power uh, i got myself a little nuke and now I'm gonna build the shield. The shield is gonna be pretty useful for the rest of the easter egg, but like I said, bots are pretty stupid, so they won't get the shield themselves, so you're the only one who's gonna be using it. As you can see, I just got the blender gate, so I'm pretty happy with that. I don't know the real name, alright guys, I don't know how to pronounce it, but I call them the bl blender gate. Uh, I don't know how you call them, please tell me in the comment section. Alright, so I managed to get myself to the final wolf and I'm so happy right now I could finally get to the final wolf. But it's round 12 and it's pretty tricky for me right now because I got Ballistic Knife. Don't ask me why I got this, but I got this, alright. So, uh, since I'm here for a while, I thought myself I'm gonna get the numbers for the spoon. So it's 278. And as you can see, it took me 3 rounds. Well, actually 2, two rounds, but 2 rounds and a half. To get um, the last wolf head and now I'm gonna be able to get myself the Elves Retriever and I'm gonna need the Elves Retriever for the rest of the Easter Egg as you know guys if you ever did the Easter Egg you're gonna have you're gonna need the Easter Egg uh, the Easter Egg the Elves Retriever so now as you can see I'm charging the uh, power box and I'm gonna enter the code 278 to get myself the spoon uh, unfortunately I wasn't looking uh, the elevator, elevator for <laughs> I wasn't looking <laughs> for the moment and as you can see there you go there's the elevator you can see the spoon right here it's gonna fall in the water and since I'm here and I have another charge I'm gonna go type 666 this is the number for uh, the charge of Brutus if you don't know this is a special Brutus that you need to complete the easter egg alright so let's get the spoon I'm gonna charge this power box and I'm gonna wait a while. Now, I wanted to charge my key, but as you can see, there's no zombie because every zombie get killed by the bots. And if you start charging a zombie and a bot kills that exact zombie, uh, the charge doesn't count. So you don't get the zombie soul into your keys. So you, re you have to kill the zombie yourself with the key. So this is a pretty annoying part. Alright, so now I got the spoon. I managed to get myself to the roof to get the Pack-a-Punch. Now, this is pretty easy, even though if you have some bots, this is an easy part. Uh, you get like the shield, you charge him up, you go to the roof and you hit the power box with the charge shield. So there you go. Now I have my Pack-a-Punch gun, so I managed to kill Brutus again. This is not... You, you don't have to pack a punch, but this is pretty useful for the rest. Alright, so I managed to build the uh, wallet for the acid gate. So now, as you can see, I'm gonna use my blender gate to get the acid gate. And you don't really need the acid gate, but it's just pretty useful. And it's gonna be very helpful for the rest of the easter egg. Alright, so now I'm going, to, I'm going to the warden house. And this is where it's starting to get annoying. I'm gonna scratch the wall with a spoon. And now we just wait for a goddamn warden to spawn. Unfortunately, it didn't spawn for like five or six rounds. I don't exactly remember, but it, it didn't spawn for a long, long time. As you can see, I'm, I'm round 21 and the first warden just spawned. Unfortunately, I couldn't get him upstairs because the bots just start killing him. So I had to wait for the next goddamn warden and the next goddamn warden was in round 26. Uh, out of there, <laughs> it's actually run 21, but they actually kill it again. So I'm stuck to this part. So yeah, I think this is our answer right there, guys. Can you beat the Easter egg uh, with bots? It's a big no. All right, guys. So if you think this video was pretty useful, please subscribe, drop a like, and leave a comment if you have any question about this Easter egg or about the boat or about Call of Duty or about my channel, anything. If you have any question, drop it in the comment section. Uh, what are my thoughts about this secret? I mean, it's pretty annoying to play with bots. I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, it's very annoying. Because bots can be really useful. I mean, they protect you in so many ways. Uh, as you can see in the catwalks, I was pretty... I was protect. Like, I could walk with no gun 
and I will still still alive because of the goddamn bots. But in the same time, when you want to do the Easter egg, they just stop you. They kill Brutus every time. You can't even complete the Easter egg with this. Uh, but if you do complete the Easter egg, please leave. Uh, leave me know, all right. I want to know if you had better luck than me, cause my luck right now on this Easter egg is pretty, pretty bad. I mean, you can complete the Easter egg with only one bot, but two bots, no, that's impossible. And three bots, well, guess what? That's impossible, all right. So if you manage to complete it with three bots, please send me a screenshot. I want to see that. I want to see the end of the Easter egg with bots, all right. Uh, and I'm, I'm gonna try guys, I'm gonna keep trying and trying and trying, but this is not the first time I actually try. Uh, I did some other games off, off video. Uh, one game I actually went to around 71 and Brutus never break that goddamn wall just because the bots just keep killing him, alright? So yeah guys, that's the end of the video. Please subscribe like I said, drop a like and I'll see you guys in the next video. Alright guys, see ya!